Hello and welcome to the Pizza Kitchen. I'm your host, Brian Hernandez, and today we have a tasty recipe from the Sunshine State, California. Now this California style recipe was given to us by US Pizza Team member, Leah Skirto from Pizza My Heart in the San Francisco Bay Area. Now it features a local delicacy, Watsonville apples. It's gonna have a little bit of sweet, sour, salt, and a little bit of heat as well. It kind of covers the whole gamut. So for this pie, we're gonna need cayenne pepper, brown sugar, extra virgin olive oil, fresh chopped garlic, shredded whole milk mozzarella, Granny Smith apples, cup and char pepperoni, candy bacon, raw bulk Italian sausage, chopped green onions, and gorgonzola cheese. To candy your bacon, lightly dust both sides of bacon with cayenne pepper and brown sugar and place on a sheet pan. Cook the bacon in your pizza oven at approximately 550 degrees for 10 minutes. Feel free to slightly undercook the bacon so it cooks further when you cook the pizza. Remove from the pan and let cool, then cut into 3 quarter inch pizzas. Slice the Granny Smith apples into 1 8 inch thick slices. Brush the skin with extra virgin olive oil and sprinkle your chopped fresh garlic on top. Add the whole milk mozzarella, sliced apples, pepperoni, candy bacon, Italian sausage, and green onions. Cook in a deck oven at 550 degrees for seven to eight minutes or until it's on the darker side of golden brown. After the pie has come out of the oven, crumble your gorgonzola on top. Get it on while the pizza is still hot so it slightly melts in and combines nicely with the rest of the toppings. Do not put the gorgonzola on before you cook the pizza or it will overwhelm the flavor of other toppings. Well, there you have it guys, the Watsonville apple, courtesy of Pizza My Heart in the San Francisco Bay Area. This pie has all the flavors of the rainbow, from salt to sweet, to spicy to sour. It's the best part of this job is actually getting to taste the creations that these guys send me. So I'm gonna grab a good slice. It's got some gorgonzola, some sausage. I wanna get a slice that I can get a, a good bite of everything in here. So here we go, wish me luck. Who doesn't love apple on a pizza? That's amazing. It's, it's sweet, it's crisp, it's a little sour because you know it's a green apple, but um, it's kind of offset by the gorgonzola and all the savory flavors with the pepperoni, the sausage, the bacon. The bacon has a little bit of heat, which kind of breaks through nicely. Um, and then you got your fresh vegetables on top, green onions. I think all the flavors pair well here. Not one is overpowering the other. They blend in perfect harmony, as we all should be. It's just pizza, guys. I want to thank you all for joining me in the Pizza Kitchen. That's all the time we have today. I definitely want to thank Leah Skirto and Pizza My Heart of the San Francisco Bay Area for giving us this recipe. It's delicious. I urge you guys to try it out in your restaurants or your homes. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. I'm your host, Brian Hernandez. But until then, keep those ovens lit.